Hi everyone, welcome to Narration Technologies. In this video, so I am going to explain how to construct an empty array, a two dimensional array, how to read elements from the end user storing into the array, two dimensional array, we can say that matrix and how to display the elements. So here we are importing that numpy module first. And whenever we are constructing the two dimensional array, it's a number of rows and number of columns. First, here it is I am asking integer of input, input enter row size, how many number of rows. So that we are collecting into a variable suppose called m, m. And next here it is n is equal to how many number of columns, input here it is enter, enter column size, enter column size, how many number of columns. So and then here we are constructing, we know how to construct means in the, in the numpy module there is a predefined object called nd array, it is expecting the two things, first one is a shape, shape and it is a tuple. We need to specify the row value and the column value comma what type of data by default it is a flow type in a previous sessions already we discussed and here it is I just want to store only integer type. So this is the way we, we are constructing next and this is the matrix and how many number of elements I want to read elements I just want to collect the input from the end user. For example, is a number of rows are 3, number of columns are 3. So it is 3 by 3 matrix. So total number of elements are 9 elements, 9, it is like simply to say size. So clearly I want to specify print enter, enter percentage D. So what is that percentage D, percentage that is M is multiplied with the N format specifiers here suppose m value is a 3 and n value is also 3 so 3 is multiplied with a 3 is a 9 enter 9 elements enter 9 elements it's total clearly we mention or clearly into 3 by 3 matrix 2 by 3 matrix 2 3 by 2 matrix like that also if you want to mention elements of Suppose 3 by 3, percentage D, percentage D matrix is so very clearly we mentioned like this. So here it is a, in this place we need to write M comma N value. So the first value M into N will store here and next here it is a M value will store in the second place of percentage D, N value will store in the third place of percentage D like clearly enter 9 elements of 3 by 3 matrix or enter 6 elements of 2 by 3 matrix or enter 6 elements of 3 by 2 matrix like this it will ask the message clearly. So we need to collect all the elements. So to process only one nothing but a one dimensional array one loop is required. Here it is a multi dimension for loop i in the range of number of rows m. And next for j in the range of n, n, m rows and n columns. Every time we are reading the input, integer only, so we are converting and that we are collecting, we are collecting into matrix of ij, matrix of ij, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 2 like this. This is for reading. This is for reading. After reading, I am printing the matrix. Print clearly the matrix. It is like a 3 by 3, 2 by 3 like this only we are writing. Suppose here it is percentage D, percentage D matrix is and once again here percentage D M comma N we are giving. So whatever the matrix we constructed that we are printing. So how this program gets executed? Suppose so whenever we execute, it is expecting what is the row size. For example, three rows. 
here it is a column size here it is a 3 so clearly it is saying that enter 9 elements of 3 by 3 matrix so then we are giving 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 look at this the 3 by 3 matrix is all the elements it is showing for example once again we are executing this code row size suppose is a 2 column size is a 3 then 2 by 3 is nothing but 2 into 3 6 elements so 1 2 3 4 5 6 so here it is a 2 by 3 matrix 2 rows and 3 columns it is mentioning clearly so this is how we are reading the elements into two dimensional array so that is constructed using nd array of numpy module so hope you understood for more videos please subscribe to narishati channel thank you